Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. So I know it's been a hot minute. There are some, have been some updates, but we're getting on to that. I know I probably should have worn some glasses, Jesus. Okay, so the Gladiator has gotten the power steps installed. So that is coming in a future video, but this one's gonna be in regards to the trip to the Washington Auto Show, which is something I've legitimately been waiting for two years to do. So let's get to that. You know what the deal is, like, comment, subscribe, let go. Um, I've usually only had a trouble in first and second gear, but really I'm getting, the more I do it, the I'm getting better, of course, but that's just with muscle memory. I'm fine with this. It's not a sign that says don't mean kind of wondering if right now yep sir um, gotta admit this looks nice <laughs> yeah it has the transmission and the intake from the gt350 so it actually is more than just a body kit oh yeah I guess the seat ain't working. <laughs> this is what happens at all the auto shows. No stick ball or anything because people take it. That's actually a really strong, that's a good kind of debate on that. Cause you, it will definitely handle better, but still. It's completely off. So I can't move the seat for anything. <laughs> this is a, there's a little, it's a little snug. Yeah, it looks like you're a little snug. <laughs> it has a height limit of five foot four. <sighs> you want to try? You're gonna hit your head. Never. <laughs> this does look really, really nice, though. And honestly, the more I see it, the more I'm really, really liking gray. Or the what? Made a comeback over the past couple of years. Oh yeah, it. I started liking it on the Challengers. Yeah. Every time I see like the new model, I keep on getting hyped for the Zora, just because I know it's coming. It's going to be big. And I'm gonna hold on to my deposit for five fucking years if it takes for that to happen. That red caliber is a freaking killer, too. Oh, yeah, the red calibers look very, very nice. Yeah, there you go. Wow, these are actually pretty good for cloth seats. This is actually is really, really nice. What the fuck? Oh, it's a person on the trunk. <laughs> <laughs> Just sitting in the middle of the guy fucking around on the trunk all here with... <laughs> I gotta admit, the more I see the wide body, the more I feel like I can't see myself driving the non-wide body version. It has to be awesome. 
In some instances, brown with green and with green can work. This is not one of those instances, I feel like. Yeah, that's true. Well, up to different perspectives. Billabai, we put a hell can another one. First bacon push button to start. I, I don't need to do that. I don't want to get kicked out. So do you know, it. We're, just, we're just gonna do this. We're gonna sit just and enjoy the view. It. We're not gonna start it up. Because that would be not good. Evan, it says push brake to start. I don't want to get kicked out. I just got here. Before we leave. Yeah. Right before we leave. This does look nice though, and I really wish the Gladiator had that size of an infotainment system. Soon. Later. I don't know. I don't want to get kicked out, but maybe I'll do it. I'll wait until I, but right before I go. <laughs> Fiat really out here representing today. I would readily go out and buy an old out. Aria EV, a second electric vehicle from Nissan Leaf, has been here for over 10 years. That's the new Aria right there. Do I get one? Both Do I not? I honestly don't know. I am a series on the fence now. Let me know down below. Do you think this would be something that would be cool to drive if you want to see? I don't know about the proto spec where you get the bronze wheels, but definitely something I have been interested in for a long time. It just absolutely looks awesome. Your gift, and you can still win. You don't need a perfect. Oh yeah. Dodge has just been making the roof black, but I think that's more so for reflection purposes. Oh okay, that, that exhaust looks nice. Never seen an epic not the not from the back. They've been doing that since the IS. Shit. Well, I got a lot to learn then. It There's a lot some cars I really need to pick up on. I mean, yeah, all they are missing is to play the theme song. That's like one of the best things about wait, staying up until like 2 a.m. is just playing the Need for Speed Underground theme song on loop. Okay, I got R34 there. What, the... Seen you in a is that that that's not Randy's SVJ. Randy's SVJ is gray, or did he get wrapped? I remember seeing this. Beautiful. <laughs> huh. Last time I saw you, you had different wheels. Still looks beautiful though, the whole carbon fiber. I wish it was opened up, but it still looks amazing. <laughs> That's a Pagani. The dude over there calling it for Robbie. <laughs> yeah, I think so. I don't know. I think I remember seeing uh, there was a blue one that I sent you a picture of, and it was out in Connecticut. It just looked absolutely amazing. If you know, you know. <laughs> Capital Auto Club, you do some nice shit. In Savage Garage, you do too. We've seen you nerf fighting. People can get inside of the big boy. Uh, yeah, we're gonna try a thing.
Give me like five minutes. Um, get it. It's a little more lifted. Oh, yeah, no, there's. There, wow. It's actually roomier than it looks. Like, this is actually pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, no, this is pretty nice. Yeah. GoPro turn. Oh, come on. Graceful Swan. You're like two years older than me, dude. <laughs> Shit. I accidentally flipped it on myself. All right. All right. <laughs> now the lovely thing of Graceful Swan getting out of the big boy. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. How do you do? I think you did pretty good. You want to go up there and uh, do it again? <laughs> Well, you know. but you know hurts rent racer How do you open it? as an unexpected portion of the vlog I'm doing something heretic I'm sitting inside the fucking Mach E press the button ah, no. and then no, you struggle not. You're not sitting in. I guess I'm not okay thank you you're sitting in now <laughs> <laughs> Okay. You could be the guy that just sat in the trunk and will replicate his bitch. Sit in the front trunk. I'm never saying the word frunk ever again outside of saying that I'm never saying the word frunk. Because it sounds, it sounds weird, okay? Can I touch your frunk? <laughs> that does, that sounds like a crime. Didn't know I was about to do this, but this is apparently how you open it. Don't look at me. <laughs> My fate is sealed. <laughs> oh, yeah, the copyright needs you fucking. <laughs> you know, I, honestly, I gotta say, my only gripe with this was the Mustang name. Aside from this, it's actually a fairly nice thing. Like, I like it. It was, you know, part of their global brand and Mustang fits. Oh, yeah. Oh, right. Uh, Mustang. Do I, uh, trying to figure this thing out? You broke it. Imagine trying to carjack this thing. This is, this is the door handle. This is the door Yeah. The door handle. Yeah, that's legit how you open it. This is, I've locked myself inside of a Corvette before because the new one's got the little button and everything. Not here, but you press it. Oh, there we go. We did it. Thank you, random person. Here. How's it feel? Oh. I don't think I get paid quite much money. Oh no. I mean, it starts out, I think, at 35. Oh, never mind. We're good. You're good. We're gonna go order one right now. Oh yeah. Uh, let's I, let's go know, get it, and you know that. Please do not touch this display. Um, oh, you no. got to use the dial. Uh, oh, here, hit the hit the oh, thing again. We got it. The yeah, the do not touch button. That was a thing. Try now. Right. Nice. Oh, it's a little good. I was thinking it was gonna close all the way, but it hasn't. Oh, you get a wait. Hold up. You get a little drawing thing on there. Yeah. That is awesome. Don't, don't, hey. What'd you think I was gonna do? Something that would get me demonetized, boy. 
just I don't know draw your favorite character on there or something I don't know put in a stall folder that's even more inappropriate not with a monster can Startup 2020 Jeep Gladiator Launch Edition. I know it's a V6, I know it could sound better, but you know what? Those, uh, those things will all come in due time. With that, that's gonna have to be with this video. I'll be sure to get to the upgrade updates on the Gladiator in due time. That'll come fairly shortly. 
So if you want to be absolutely amazing, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment down below of stuff you would like to see in the future, because I'm very much considering looking to something sporty for the channel, because I honestly feel like that would be so much fun, because on the ride back here, my friend who has the uh, has a uh, an NV Miata, here's a little picture of what that generation looks like. Those things are actually pretty fun for the little box that they are. They're, they're actually pretty damn fun to ride in. And I think it would be kind of cool if I drove one. But then again, I kind of feel like just sporty in general, I have to do my own thoughts on it and see exactly what I feel comfortable with. But you know what? Hit the like button, leave a comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one.